I remember when I was a kid, we used to go out with friends and family, and I was like 10 years old in the backseat of my cousin's ride, cruising down San Bernardino E Street, hitting Whittier, uh, hitting Hollywood, all that stuff when I was a kid. It was always a vision for me, myself, to be out there with my ride. I'm the average, the average one, average drove. I got a nine to five job, I work for a living, take care of my family. Um, it's hard to build a car. It's not, you don't got money coming out just like that. You know, so you take cars in step. You do what you can, and that's what I expect from my members as well. Do what you can. My ATL Camino was painted by one of my club members. They have Westlife Customs out in Riverside. Uh, they did all the paint work on my ride. We went with the Chrysler 300 burgundy color with a little bit of flake we added to it. The striping we added was by Jeff from Pomona. I believe he's from Pomona. He did the work for us on that. Uh, we got the 72 Crossley spokes on here. Build your cars. Everybody has their own ideas. Everybody has their own vision. So you don't knock someone on what they're doing or how they're doing their car. You inspire people. To me, that's what the low riding game is about. You show off what you, you the hard uh, work that you put into your cars, the time, the effort, the arguments with your old ladies and stuff. You know, arguments with fellow club members on things. But low riding, it's a passion. It's a way of life. It's what you love to do. I love it. I never give it up. You know, it's, it's not a hobby. It's not a phase. It's not a temporary thing. Not for me. It's been in my blood for years. I'm going to keep going with this.